All right, guys, so as most of you know, I've had a hair transplant. I had a multi-unit hair grafting procedure done 17 years ago. One of the things I love to do every few years to keep my transplant and non-transplant hair healthy and strong is a platelet-rich plasma treatment. Let's go, let's follow me through the process. All right, so as you can see, the area we're doing the treatment is really convenient, straight in off the, uh, off the main foyer area. So come around here and there's a couple of phases here. Phase one is having the blood draw. So this is where we draw the blood in preparation to spin out the platelet-rich plasma, the high concentration platelet-rich plasma that we need. This just takes a few minutes done here in this room. Then we go to treatment room. So this is where the magic happens, so to speak. And it's very efficient in here. So the whole idea here is to make the comfort level for you, the patient, as high as possible. One of the things we really love is this little chiller right here. So the chiller actually is used to blow very, very cold air onto the area that we're injecting. We're not using any topical medications. We want the efficacy of the field that we're injecting into to be the best it possibly can. So this chiller ensures your comfort level. It also means we're not using any medications which would require you to have someone else drive you here and someone else drive you home. You can drive here and drive home yourself. So literally no disruption to the remainder of your day after a treatment. We do recommend that night you go home, you take a warm shower, just to help the plate, the rich plates would disperse subcutaneously under the surface. So the whole treatment process is typically about 45 minutes. Now, it will vary a little bit patient to patient depending on what we're doing, but the actual part in here where we're injecting the plasma is really efficient, 10, 15 minutes maybe, just to step you through that process. Again, the key is your comfort level as we go through that, so we ensure that it's the best it can possibly be. Okay guys, a couple of things in preparation for my treatment today. Really important to understand, nothing steroidal in the last two weeks. Second thing, in the last 48 hours, no ibuprofen. Those things can actually reduce inflammation in the body. What we're doing with platelet-rich plasma is we're actually creating inflammation to get the result that we're looking for. The other thing I did this morning was I stopped my Rogaine. Now, you don't have to do that, but my personal experience is when you do Rogaine the morning of your treatment, it just makes the scalp a little bit more sensitive. So comfort level, important to me, so I stopped my Rogaine this morning. Otherwise, pretty straightforward. All right, blood draw time, guys, quick and easy. Girls are very experienced at this, so again, another easy part of the process. I think one of the things that's really important when you have a treatment like this done is that you're working with experienced people, and it's the whole team, right? So it's the person that's doing the blood draw, the people that are doing the injections um, and injecting the plasma. You know, we have a lot of experience. We do you know, hundreds of these literally every month, so they're very, very good at what they do. So as you can see, the blood draw is easy, guys. This only takes a few minutes. Then the blood will be spun in a centrifuge where we're going to separate out that high concentration platelet-rich plasma. Okay, so we're basically prepping the plasma at this point, guys. Oh, thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. And that's going to take about 12 to 15 minutes just to separate out that high concentration plasma. Then we're going to go to the next step, which is actually um, administering the PRP into the top of the scalp. This is the separated red blood cells, and this is um, a buffy coat. What it is, is it's like a separator that separates the red blood cells from the plasma. And the platelets actually adhere right along this buffy coat, right through here. And that's why we pull off the platelet pore from the top, so as not to get any of the platelets that are down in this area. And then once we pull off that pore, then we're going to invert the tube to loosen those platelets into the plasma. Good morning. Morning. My name's Joanne. I'll be doing okay. your treatment today. Okay. Um, do you have any questions for me before we get started? Uh, no. Pain? You know, everyone's perception is a little bit different, but we do, okay. do use a couple of devices here to try to keep you as comfortable as possible. Okay. First thing we're going to do is we have a chiller, which is going to blow compressed cold air over the area. Okay. Everyone's tolerance to the cold is different. Okay. Some people like it very cold and some people more of a distraction. Okay. So as we get going, I'll be asking, how are you doing? And okay. we can alter that throughout. Perfect. I also have a little device that kind of vibrates across the, the scalp. And what it's doing is it's just blocking neural pathways. So your okay. brain's saying, hey, what's going on up there? So okay. it's trying to ignore what I'm doing. Okay. Silver lining of the treatment is it's very fast. Okay. Once I get going, I will pulse along throughout the, the top of the head as quickly okay. as I can. Perfect. But with that being said, at any time, if you need a break or if you need me to slow down, we can most certainly do that okay. for your tolerance as well. Perfect. 
Um, is there an area of particular concern that you're wanting me to target or are you looking for a more comprehensive treatment? Um, yeah, so this front or central area here, kind of that, that area, and the crown, the center area is kind of the third area. So okay. um, one, two. Okay. Yep. And, and fortunately with the tubes that we use, I have lots of product. I will give lots of love to the two areas that you initially spoke about, but then we'll have plenty and I'll just kind okay. of fill in in, the, in between. Perfect. And again, just let me know how you're doing and kind of change things up as we get going. I sure will. Thank Alrighty. you. So all you really feel, guys, here is just a little bit of pressure. Uh, I don't personally feel that needle go in at all. Uh, I just feel a little bit of subcutaneous pressure when... Um, when you can feel the product uh, be dispensed. So yeah, it's really comfortable. I personally like it a little bit colder than a lot of people do. Um, but uh, yeah, it's really comfortable. tight, heavy, kind of strange feeling. Some people describe it as I'm wearing my football helmet, too yep. tight feeling. Yeah. That should go away over the next couple of hours. Okay. Um, you might have just a little bit of point tenderness here okay. for a day or so. Okay. Usually people are not even Tylenol tender. Okay. But if you do have any discomfort over the next 48 hours, remember we do want you to take Tylenol, not okay. an anti-inflammatory, because sure. we are trying to stim in stimulate inflammation to Got that it. area. And I can take a hot shower tonight to help um, it? You could resume normal showering, okay. shampooing routine even. Some people find that hot steamy shower feels good yep. um, with the perfusion to kind of get that tight heavy feeling to go away okay. more quickly. Okay. So. Guys, that was great. It's super comfortable. Um, you know, I was never in any discomfort. I could feel a little pressure as it went in. There were some areas that are a little more sensitive than others, but really it's nothing. You know, so great treatment. It was awesome. You're all set. Thank you. All right, guys, it's 10 past nine, walked in at 8.15, treatment is done, ready to go about my day. That was super easy. For me, as I mentioned, every few years, love to do some PRP. Now, the number of treatments you need is gonna be based on what your particular needs are. Our professional team will guide you through that. For me, it's on with my day and uh, busy day coming up.